were about to learn what a tourist captured that no one was supposed to see, but makes us wonder what other terrifying and amazing things have been found in waterholes like swamps. You can't generally see them above the surface, so everything you pull up is either good or bad surprise. Coming up are 10 terrifying things found in swamps. Before we go on, subscribe, like and turn on notification bell so you don't miss any of my video that I upload. Number 10. The Window for Cement. In 1982, a road was being built to create access to a brand new housing development in Florida called Window for Farms. During the construction process, the operator got the shock of his life when he found schools in his machine's bucket. The medical examiner identified them as not recent, but forensic experts think they were modern Caucasian remains. And so the journey to understanding what they were looking at began. Where those remains were found is now known as window for archaeological site and it takes back to 6000 to 5000 BC. It is now a national historic landmark. In total, the pond the operator dug into contained the remains of 160 people who were buried at the bottom of the pond. Number 9. Swamp King Gator the crocodiles we have today are terrifyingly large enough and Astoria seems to take one of the team by having the most terrifying and dangerous animals in the world. But nevertheless, we had a lucky escape when a prehistoric crocodile measuring over 5 meters was found in southeast Greenland in 1980s. It was called something. The school alone measured 65 centimeters which would put the terrifying beast in total at 16 feet long. We also have giant crocodiles today, which grow to around the same size as this prehistoric crocodile, but the Swamp King would have been much heavier and much broader going by the size of its skull. People have managed to work out how exactly it went extinct. Some of the more common theories are that the crocodile species we had today caused some problems for it. Otherwise, climates have dried up and waterways may have become unlivable for a crocodile as massive as this one. Number 8. A teeth at four tank. One of the last things you would expect to pull from a swamp is a World War II tank. But that was a reality for a group of people who found one and removed it from a lake around 60 years after they would have entered it. The Russian built teeth at four tank that appeared to have been repainted with German markings and either became stuck in battle or was abandoned when Germans retreated. They may have also been possibly driven into the lake to, spot, to stop the advancing Soviet army for reclaiming it. It was found in 2 feet of water with around 6 feet of silt covering it. Local diving club Flonius spent two weeks washing it, the silt off before pulling it to the shore and removing 116 pieces of ammunition. When the tank was removed from the water, it was taken to the war museum. Number 7. Old Krogan Man Old Krogan Man was an Irish body from between 362 and 175 BC that was found in a well-preserved condition in 2003. It got its name from Krogan Hill, near where the body was found in Ireland. Now it's on display in Dublin International Museum of Ireland. As the body was so well preserved, the researchers have managed to learn a lot about his life. He would have been about 6 feet 6 inches tall, which was incredibly tall for the time. He also had a well manicured nails, which likely meant he was someone of high status rather than involved in manual labor. Old Kogan man even had food in his stomach consisting of wheat and buttermilk which would have been his last meal. Some researchers believe he would have been a king or prince sacrificed due to poor weather and harvest. Number 6. Thousands of Bones 2015 was an exciting year for international researchers and the National Heritage Foundation. They were fortunate enough to rediscover a swamp in Mauritius. According to that description, there was a swamp so full of extinct animal bones. You had to put your hand in the water to get them. 
This inspired a research team to go and search for it and they found what they were looking for. They managed to find many bones belonging to extinct Mauritius animals with incredible diversity. According to the doc doctor of National History Museum, it was one of the most exciting fossil excavations he had worked on. He said the sheer volume of remains were incredible and some of the materials dated back 12,000 years which meant it was the oldest fossil site in the entire western Indian Ocean. Number 5. Nuclear Bomb In February 1958, the United States Air Force lost a nuclear bomb weighing at 400 kilograms in the water near Savannah, Georgia. During a practice exercise, an AF-86 fighter plane and a B-47 bomber carrying a bomb collided. A search started the next day with 100 Navy personnel and the explosive disposal squad. They used a variety of tools and technology to locate it but were ultimately unsuccessful. However, based on a historic survey, they thought it may be buried in 15 feet of set at the bottom of water. Today, it remains missing. Number 4 Single in Louisiana. In August of 2012, a wall of an empty salt mine broke 5,000 feet underground. Before long, rock and dirt had poured into it, which then started filling with water, and that was just the beginning. In less than a year, the single had grown to 25 acres of surface level and over 350 feet deep at its lowest point. It was also expected to double in size back in 2013. By 2014, it had grown in size by an acre. When you don't know how it was created, it just looked like an ordinary swamp. Bubbles of air sometimes reach the surface and crocodiles have been now mainly swamp. Every now and then, it randomly starts consuming trees and it's incredibly unpredictable since the salt mine collapsed at sight rather than the top. Number 3. Pumper Coil Plenty of absurd things are found in swamps, but the very last thing that should be inland is a young dead amper coil. At the time of the year that it was found in a remote swamp in the Amazon River, it should have been migrated thousands of miles through Antarctica, which makes the find even more absurd. Members of the conservation group found the wild in 2019 not far from the shore after following scavenging birds that were circling overhead. Eventually, they found the dead 26 feet long while in the woods. Crew members think it had been floating and the tide took it into the mangrove. They were not sure why it was there at all. They were simply had no explanation for why a humpback whale was on the northern coast of Brazil in February. Number 2. Homo halgas. If you pay a visit to the nature reserve in Francis Gulf of Mobihan, you will notice something quite strange in the zombie water. Something strange that also blends in with their surroundings so well that at first you may not notice them. However, they will quickly reveal themselves as beautiful fingers named Omohalgas, made by man and seaweed. The algae dress with the elements and their texture and colors change over time. People started noticing two creatures emerging from the mud that had been positioned on the edge of the coastal path. They were then placed at the nature reserve. If you didn't know the story behind these creatures, you would likely be terrified if you spot at them in a swamp. Number 1. Yonjana Condor They mostly live in slow-moving streams and swamps and can be found in rainforests. As these non venomous constrictors can grow around 17 feet long uh, or over 5 meters, they find it easier to move around when they are in the water. As you can probably imagine, green agnacodas are the heaviest non snake species and also one of the longest. They eat everything they can overpower, like fish, birds, mammals, and reptiles. They eat by floating just below the water surface and then striking when prey stops to drink the water. They then coil their bodies around their prey and constrict it around until it is suffocates. Have you seen anything terrifying at, in or near a swamp? 
प्लीज कॉमेंट डाउन बिलो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग